Alright, so I'm very excited to show you the new PyFest control and display. So today I'm just going to show you um, how to set it up and what it will do. So control and display um, is a LCD uh, display which will display status information for the Raspberry Pi and then a series of buttons uh, that you can use to interact um, with the Raspberry Pi. It's also got an infrared receiver. So it's really easy to set up and I'm just going to run you through a short video showing how to do it. So the first thing we do is we have, with the Raspberry Pi turned off, we just plug it on, so that's nice and simple. Just connect up the Raspberry Pi as usual. So you've got network, keyboard, mouse, power, monitor, I've just got a new um, SD card with noobs already installed, so I'll put that in. Power it up. Install. And confirm yes. So this is just all very standard. And then we wait a little while and Raspbian will be installed. So noobs have installed Raspbian successfully now, so if I just click OK. So the Pi reboots. Yeah. So Raspbian boots up into Raspberry Config and there's a few options we need to change now. Uh, we need to go to Advanced Options and then choose Update. Now your Raspberry Pi might take a few minutes to update, it depends on how many updates there are um, between the version on the card and the, the latest version. So I've updated Raspberry Config and now we need to go to Advanced Options and A5 SPI, so we press enter and it says would you like the SPI kernel module to be loaded by default? We want it to be, at the moment its current setting is now, so we've got yes selected, we press enter, it confirms that that will be the case, we click OK. Now because it's a new card we need to tell it to expand the file system, so that's the first option, press enter, press OK, it's fine, and then we go finish. So we've logged in, and now I'm going to type sudo apt get install hyphen dash pyface cad. Now I also want to install the Python 3 libraries, so I'm also going to type in Python 3 dash my face CAD and I press enter and it goes off to fetch the packages it says do I wish to confirm so I've put yes and I press enter now one of the things you'll notice when it does the install it says here that please reboot before using PyFace control and display so I'll wait until the command line comes back and then I'll type sudo reboot so it's asking me to log in so I'll type in at username pi and then the password is raspberry and then first thing I'm going to do is run the sample program which gets installed to test control and display so I do that by typing in python 3 and then I put a space and then I need to tell it where the sample program it is and the sample program is user so usr slash share slash doc slash Python, and then I'm just going to press tab so it also completes and gives me the options. So then I've got, um, I can do Python 3 dash PyFace CAD, and then into the examples folder, and then sysinfo.py. So now if I run that, you'll see the screen lights up, and you get the IP address of the current. Um, of the Raspberry Pi, it's also displaying what the temperature of the CPU is and uh, how much activity is being used, in this case 5.9%. So that's just a really easy way of seeing that you've got uh, Raspberry Pi, the Pi first control display successfully installed. I'll press Control c and then I'll finish that and that's the first example of how to um, install control and display from scratch on noobs 
using a couple of commands and we've also got the um, example program as well.